What's up, everybody? Welcome to another Me Time Game. Hopefully, everybody's going fantastic as usual. Today, we'll be playing some uh, Quantum Break. Uh, just got it, just released today. So, on the whatever date it is today, I don't remember. It doesn't matter. Uh, so, um, I've been waiting for this game along. I, I would have to admit, I probably bought my Xbox one for that last year. So, uh, yeah, so hopefully, it's going to be a good game. So far, of what I've heard, it seems like a pretty good game. So. Without further ado, let's start playing the game. River Port University Experiments Quantum Break Insights. Search the surroundings for optional. Killer is time. The number one killer is time. It destroys us all. This is what you need to know. Time broke. A growing fracture leading to the end of time. We went after a device that could fix it. Things turned ugly. Paul's friend was there to stop us. He has superpowers. Jack? Him and me both. We should pay him. Jack. And of course, time travel was involved. Jack. Going too fast for you? Okay. What do you want to cover first? You tell me. Let's start at the beginning. When you first arrived at Riverport University. <coughs> I came back home to see my best friend, Paul Serene. He wanted to show me what he'd been working on. Riverport University. Paul said it was world changing. He was right. Whoa! Come on! Watch where you're going, man! Fuck off! Get out of the road! Riverport University. Here we are. Thanks for the ride. No problem. You'd been away for six years. Paul and I had kept in touch, but, well, not so much. How did it make you feel? I was just happy to see Paul. My button was stuck. Show you <coughs> my button with stuff shows you that I haven't I'm gonna use my, my Xbox. Straight I guess I should go find Paul. If you're with that fraternity, you've done enough damage. We're being shut down. <laughs> Hey, I come in peace. I'm just meeting a friend nearby. At 4 a.m.? Yeah, tell me about it. Well, we're spreading awareness about Monarch Solutions, so if you want to know how badly they're giving us the shaft, then you can just ask me. All right, what's going on here? Okay. How would you feel if you knew a corporate monopoly was taking a massive dump all over your personal history? That's quite, uh, that's quite an opener. Good. Because that beautiful <coughs> library over there is over a hundred years old. It's part of the city's heritage. And Monarch Solutions plans to tear it down tomorrow. You want to know why? We've got a chart with all the details. Monarch's tearing down the library to build another research facility. And for what? I bet you're going to tell me. Hmm, to push their corporate agenda. I mean, look at those numbers. They're slowly taking over the city, and everybody's completely blind to it. No, it doesn't look good. Hey, I gotta meet my friend, but you keep fighting this, okay? All right. Enjoy your booty call. <laughs> Not exactly. <laughs> Alrighty. Hey, 
protests over at home. It's not why I'm here, Chief. Thanks for that safety whistle. Where's your uniform? Excuse me. Come on. I've been in shit enough to smell insecurity. You sure this is somebody you want to be sniffing around? Was that supposed to be a threat? Because that's adorable. Just walk away. You made a long trip just to see a research project? Well, reading between the lines, Paul was under a lot of pressure. He needed a friend. I wanted to help him any way I could. Son of a bitch. Jack Joyce. In the flesh. The esteemed Mr. Paul Serene. You shake your money bag. Shut up and bring it in. <laughs> Welcome home. What's up, money bag? Donor. Donor car. Years. Now we're starting to think we'd never come back. Yeah, me too. Come on. This way. We're going upstairs to the project lab. How was the flight? First class. Thank you for that. It's a step up from our van trip to Utah. I missed that. I'm guessing Will's not meeting us. He doesn't know we're here. I knew Paul had asked my brother Will to consult on his project. Will was all the family I had, but it was difficult. There's more to this than you're letting on. Is it about my brother? You still worry about him, huh? If Will did something wrong, then... Jack, man. Look, I've been tight-lipped about this for a reason. This project we've been working on is going to change the entire world. Uh, why do I smell one of your long-winded presentations on the horizon? I would never. Oh, look. <laughs> A perfectly placed presentation to illustrate the project. Now, who put that there? <laughs> oh, shocking. Okay. Enough joking. The lab's this way, Jack. Come on. Keeping behind this door, guy. Exactly what I thought I was gonna. You guys must have some budget. What is all this? The future, Jack. You are looking at the biggest discovery in our time. It's impressive, but Will's the scientist. What do you need me for? There's a reason we're doing this at 4 a.m., Jack. I need someone I can trust. I need you to help me convince Will. Yeah, I had a hunch. When your brother found out the scope of what we were building here, he. <laughs> well. You know Will. Yeah. Hang on, I gotta get something from my desk. Will overreacted. Scared off the investors, ranting about miscalculations, dangers, all with no evidence. It works. But they're gonna cut our funding if I don't prove it. I see the concept of personal space is still foreign to you. Hey, somebody's gotta keep tabs on you. not easy for me. I am in deep trouble. You see, the tests I have to run here are not, strictly speaking, legal. You're the only one I can trust to help me with this. Whatever Will did, I want to make it right. I love my older brother, but he didn't make it easy. It's already essentially set up. Anyone can do it, but you're the one I want to do this with. Jack, thank you. And look at counting me. All right. That's just the Cronon conduit initiating. Are you sure? 
to find out this way they've got to raise the corridor just like old times eh? slightly illegal moderately reckless I'd raise some hell with Paul in the past I could tell this was different still I didn't understand how massive and far-reaching the consequences for this would be how could I I knew Paul he played it cool but I could tell he was nervous Damn it. we're really doing this Jack it's going to be amazing. Here, take this. You need this key to activate the corridor. We need to turn the keys at the same time to activate security precautions. Ready? It's like we're launching a nuke. Wait, we're not launching a nuke. Right? One way to find out. <laughs> Three, one way to find out. Two, one. God damn, Paul. What is this? The corridor. The passenger enters one end, travels around the loop, exits the other, and arrives at the predetermined time in the physical location where the machine is situated in that time. Passenger. Wait, wait, wait. This is a corridor for. You're actually going inside that thing in the machine through time it's a fucking time machine it's a fucking time machine i'm going to be the first jack and you're my witness this is crazy paul i mean this can't be safe what happens when our team has already proved it works in the trial phase it is ready we've passed every test every inspection we're about to make history jack all you have to do minutes to the past remember this moment Paul <laughs> what how it <laughs> it's fine Okay, stay calm, Jack. Stay calm. There's, there's two of you. You just fucking multiply. This is exactly what was supposed to happen. That's he's he's me, a future version of me from two minutes in the future. <laughs> Your evil future self. We did it. It's fucking incredible. I mean, just imagine the implications. We could warn people about disasters before they Disaster happen. Before they happen. Cure, cure disease, disease before, before they, they spread. spread. I just had this conversation. <laughs> Goes down to the second time. Jesus Christ. Now go into the machine. Keep the key separate. Yeah. Yes. Of course. Wait, Paul. What are you doing? It's all a big loop, Jack. I need to enter the machine and travel back to the moment I exited the machine in order to... And what if you don't? There is no what if. I'm here, it's already happened. You saw it, Jack. We did it. Well, that's impossible. That's that's literally impossible. I mean, I can't even... There's no time to stop now. We need to test the other direction. Set the machine to five minutes to the future. I'm immediately qualified to. Uh, what are you uh -oh. doing? Oh no. Jack. Will? You have to help me with this. We have to shut this thing down now. No, 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 no. Stop him. Shut up. Hold, hold on. The core. Hold on. We can't shut it down. Paul's still in there. Will. Shut up. Look shut at me. up. Look at me. Put the gun down and we can talk. Okay? No, there's no time. You're not thinking straight. Put the gun down. 
Jesus Christ, Will. Time is going to end. Yeah, he has to trust me. For what? You're not letting nobody out. I guess that's not good. You okay? I think so. I'll find a way out. Make sure Will's okay. Yeah. Okay. Uh. What the fuck's going? I could hear Will's words in my head. You're not a scientist, Jack. How do you know you broke time? I guess you could figure that out. Just, uh, Is this really happening? just looking at him. <laughs> I didn't want to leave Paul, but there was no way to help me. I didn't know where he'd end up. What the hell? Hurry! This way! Keep moving. No! Just what? move. Part two. This way. That was a weird uh, cut. Part two. Started to manifest. 
out of control burst of energy that saved Lake. Campus escape. Jack, the proximity to the pulse. It, it must have altered your relation to the chrono. Well, what I just did back there. What the hell is happening? That's what I'm telling you. Not in the right language. I'll try to explain, but we have Beep to go. Boots. Explosions make time go bad. If time is an egg, then that egg is fucking broken. If a time egg, it's fucked. What? Why is there an egg in me? There's a fracture in time. It's breaking down. Leading to the end of time and door. Uh, what? Locked. They cut my security clearance. Uh, that didn't help. Stand back. I'll get it open. HQ. Securing the well, room. Over. More of them. Hide. They're coming. Burning hot. I tried to make him listen to me by shoving a gun in my face. Yes, a gun. The universal symbol for shut the fuck up and listen. Sound logic is always Shh. Shh. you. Paul brought me here to clean up your mess. My mess? Do you even... That should, that should be no everything for any of this burning. Jack. You weren't here. A lot happens in six years. It's bigger than us. I'm gonna make it personal. They're trying to kill us, Will. It's pretty goddamn personal. Listen, getting you involved is the last thing I wanted. I, I'm sorry. Right. Thanks, dude. They're coming back. Let's go. The fracturing time is only going to get worse. We have to stop this before it's too late. Fucking pal. First, we have to get to my car. You're better at the door thing. Shut the f Will, are you okay? I think so. But Jack, that was... I know. This is way out of hand. I'd used a gun before. I'd been in a couple tough spots. Never had an army of pro gunmen chase me. Paul was positive this experiment would work. But the figures were correct. Look at his specialists were a bunch of goddamn idiots. Their formulas were missing these variables entirely. 
You're seriously making corrections right now? Well, if they made them in the first place, we wouldn't be here. Let's get out of here. the elevator to the lobby. It's coming down. Hide. Not again. Come on, come on, come on, come on. You can do this. You can do this. There! Take him down! Watch out! These guys are where you want to be. can't go to your car. Monarch would be expecting that. We have to, Jack. It's important. To fix the fracture, I... I need... We need to get to my car. Okay, just, just walk me through this, Will. Okay, time's broken. Fine. And now you're saying we could fix it? In theory. I built something for such an event years ago. But finding the countermeasure won't be easy. The countermeasure? What the... Okay. What happened? Maybe the door still won't. Let me try. 